hi so we started this pretty abruptly but today i thought that it was good to make a one second video about the overskirt of a clover dress so now if you look on google you'll actually find at least one photo of a overskirt and a pink bodice on the clover dress so i decided to make that bodice and that today so as you can see this is the front panel of the overskirt so this is basically like an apron i guess now, as you can see, I put a little bit of curve and have the ribbons. Now, this is the back piece. So, now this back piece, it isn't like triangular cut, but as you can see, I cut away the sides. Yeah, I do a lot of questionable things. And this is just all me winging it in. And then we have, you know, that. And then they actually have like ribbons. So, basically, I want to put like, like two ribbons on the edge of each panel. And then I want to put bows. So, as you can see, this is my ribbon and now this may look impossibly long but trust me you will need more than all of this monstrosity going on here but yeah and also as you can see we have an orange caterpillar just there but you know your bodice is just you know the pretty straightforward you know standard two sheets of paper shoulder ties but i will give you a laid out bodice in case you are not familiar with this and if you do not watch my channel and yes my outfits are invading so yeah probably be not the best idea to be making a lot of big fancy dresses little do you know that i already have a whole entire stash going on upstairs filled with boxes but maybe i will do a vlogging of that later of me showing up all of my trash bag outfits because i've made thousands and thousands that you did not see on camera and this may actually give you a heart attack of of the quantity i've made without recording anything okay so basically this is you know your average two-piece bodice with shoulder ties and everything so yes it is done and basically you can use a white bodice interchangeably because the original clover dress did have a white bodice but yeah, tis done and just in time because I ran out of tape.